Over a decade after its conception, the Canadian Museum for Human Rights will open its doors this weekend with a preview for the public. The museum's director of exhibitions and digital media said the construction will be mostly wrapped up by the weekend and should be fully complete by opening weekend on the 27th. The gallery has a number of stories told around the exterior. You can see that they're finishing the, the large image grid. Uh, there's a center zone game. The Examining the Holocaust Gallery and Turning Points for Humanity Gallery were both near completion with photos, films and interactive activities for visitors to better understand human rights violations which have occurred worldwide. It takes an analytical approach rather than a commemorative approach to try and understand the mechanisms of genocide, how genocides happen. Um, so around the perimeter of the gallery there's um, some text images as well as some personal stories of Holocaust survivors. Um, in the center there's uh, a film that examines um, anti-Semitism in Canada and Canada's response to the Holocaust. And making its debut in Winnipeg on September 27th will be the original copy of the Canadian Charter for Rights and Freedoms on display for a limited time in the Protecting Rights in Canada gallery. For the Winnipeg Sun, this is Kristen Annable.